Hey guys, welcome back. So, I thought about it, and I'm actually going to say this is episode one, and the last episode as episode zero. It kind of just went over an overview of what we're looking at. With that being said, um, let's just jump into this episode. A lot of gains on this episode. Uh, well, okay, I say a lot, but it's, it's a lot for me, okay? For a normal person, it would look like nothing. They'll be like, ah, I could do that in an hour. For me, okay, it's a lot, okay? Okay, let's get into the episode. Hope you guys enjoy. So, we're doing some wood cutting right now. Uh, I was going to do Waterfall and finish up some other quests. But there's some nasty thunderstorms outside right now, and I might lose power. I don't want to lose power in the middle of Waterfall. You know, because I could die to the hill giants. Or the moss giants. Are they moss giants or hill giants? I don't remember. The giants. We'll just call them the giants for now. I don't want to die to the giants or even the fire giants. A lot of giants are inside the waterfall quest, okay? That's where I'm getting at. And a lot of giants can kill me. You know, they can no longer one-shot me, but they can probably two-tap me. Actually, they might have to three-tap me. Yeah, that's what. Their max hits 13, 14. It'd have to be a three-tap. But anyways, so we're collecting some willow logs. I'm going to fletch all these little willow logs into um, unstrung longbows. Bows, and then I'm actually going to sell them to... Um, this, this shop right here, the general store right here. Um, I've been told that it buys things at a higher price than if you were to sell it at a normal general store, which is nice because I have this area unlocked already because I've done the questing. So we're actually going to cut all of our willow long, uh, logs into willow longbows, and then sell them over here. And that story is going to be nice until I can get the magic level for uh, high elking. Um, what level is that? Uh, 55 is high elk. Do I even have... I have low elk, but apparently it's not worth using, so we're just going to sell everything to that general store. I guess it's about the same price as a low elk. So instead of wasting runes on low elk stuff myself, we're just going to world hop and sell stuff there. So right now, we're going to cut some logs. Uh, once this inventory is full, you know, we'll probably, probably take a break from wood cutting. Uh, I have gotten some levels. Uh, where are we at? Uh, we're up to level 60 now. So, we'll just show some some uh, level ups here and there. But yeah. So, with that being said, let's let's just let's go see what we have for logs. Uh, I I was cutting a bunch of oak logs. Um, for like oak planks later on, but right now we're doing the willows. So we're about 540. Honestly, that should be enough. We should just start fletching these bad boys. So we're gonna fletch these into longbows. And then from there, we're just gonna sell them to that general store. So I'm just gonna fletch these uh, if I get a level up, I'll, or a level, I keep saying level up. If I get a level in fletching, then I will come back and I'll show you how many levels we get. I don't think I'll get a level. I might. I might get one. We'll see. We'll see where we're at. But, yeah, that's where I'll leave this off right here. Uh, I'll just show some of the missed content that we've done 
I I did finish Tree Gnome Village. Where right right where are you at? Yeah, Tree Gnome Village. I finished that. Um, and that's pretty much all I've done so far. So we'll finish. We'll f we'll fletch these up, and we'll be back and. In the meantime, I'll show what I've done so far. I have a couple clips. Oh, yeah. Actually, I have some clips for you guys. I, I have. We'll, we'll show the clips now. Roll the clips. Come at you level, with level 56, level 57, level 58, 59, and level 60. Now here, you see, we're, we were doing the Tree Gnome Village quest. And this is how we safe spotted the night dude. Uh, the, oh, the warlord. That's his name. The warlord. So we kind of just got him stuck over here. And we just, you know, used mage magic. And, you know, it was pretty simple. It was quick. It was easy. We got the job done. And that's what matters. So we uh, just killed off the warlord. Now we're finishing up the quest running through the dialogue, you know, having a good old time. Now, the good thing about finishing this is we can actually use the spirit trees to teleport now, which is super nice. And we also got some uh, decent, well, you know, levels in this. You know, I think, what was it, level... Well, so we finished the quest, and then we got some attack, level 35 attack which is super nice to get, you know, and we also unlocked the spirit trees, which is also super duper amazing. So, so after we finished Tree Gnome Village, we actually came out here to the Zamrock Warriors. Um, they have a rune scimitar, scimitar drop rate of, I think it's 1 in 50, which is so much better than the Fire Giants. And actually... Actually, heard about this uh, through. I think it was one of my Discord mods, or not Discord mods, but my one of one of the guys in the Discord. And you know, so figured we'd try it out, see how it went. And yeah, we actually got a few levels of magic and whatnot. And you know, well, I won't I won't spoil too much, but you know, it was a good time. Quick run through levels, we got Magic 35, Combat 26, Magic 36, Combat 27, Magic 37, Combat 28, Magic 38. After all those great levels, we actually got a Rune Dagger. Now, mind you, a Rune Dagger is actually a 1 in 25 drop rate, which isn't, you know, isn't really that bad for a Rune Dagger. It's actually pretty nice. With that being said, though, it's not a rune scimitar. We want that rune scimitar. So we kept grinding, kept getting them levels. And, you know, we actually ended up switching over um, from Fire Strike to Firebolt because we ran out of, we were going to run out of mine roots. But again, it was nice. And then that's one of the, this was what, 36 magic is when we got the rune dagger. We already went through all of our levels that we got. Spoiler alert, it was a lot. And there you have it. Rune Stang, Rune Dank Scimitar. Oh, oh God, I was so hyped when I got this drop. I'm, I'm not even gonna lie, I was really hyped, okay? In 37 kills, I got the Rune Scimitar. And it's Zami Warriors. Look, look at the safe spot, okay? There's barely anyone here. Hey, we got a prayer level. It was great. Now. With that being said, let's roll back into our lovely, lovely fletching grind. We'll catch you back over with the fletching. Take care. And there's level 44. Uh, so I did the math. I might actually be able to get... So I, I pulled up the, uh, the tracker. So from level 43 to 50 is 1,131 actions from where I'm at right now. So I might be able to get 
level forty six, maybe. Yeah, level forty six. I might even be able to get level forty seven. But yeah, so there's level forty four. Let's see if we can make it to level fifty. I might tap into some of the oak logs. Um. I might. We'll see. Uh, the only reason I, I'm trying to get level 50, though, is for the maple short bows. Uh, the maple long bows would be nice at 55. And then, you know, darts, toxic blowpipe at 53, mithril darts, 52. And then crossbows, you know, the mithril maple crossbow would be nice. And then the broad arrows, so those are going to be nice at level 52. So yeah, we'll just see where we get to. But yeah, so that's level 44, and we'll catch you at the next level. Here's level 45, and here's level 46. And with that, all of our willow logs have been cut. Uh, so we actually... Like you just saw, we got up to level 46. We're pretty close to level 47. Let's let's just calculate. If I want level 50 at where I'm at right now, how many oak longbows will that take? I wonder if we have enough. We might have enough. It's a, almost 2,000. And we have exactly 2,000. Do I want to use up... I think I think we'll, I think we'll hold off. We'll, we'll hold off. We'll, we'll hold off. We'll wait. We'll wait. With that being said, though, let's see what else we can do. Uh, we could finish. We can actually finish dwarf cannon. I just have to go speak to him. So, yeah. I'll meet you over there. Let's see you back in a moment. So, we're back. Finish up the Dwarf Cannon Quest. I decided since we're right here, we might as well continue with the Waterfall Quest. So, I grabbed Gabriel's Pebble as well. And some Tunas. Uh, we got some decent crafting XP from that. So, did we get a level? We did get a level. Level 13. Heck yeah. So while we're here, let's go over to the lovely tomb right here. And what do we do? Do we just read it? No. Do we use it? Yep. There we go. All right. So we're going to... Yep. They're moss giants, of course. All right. So we're going to try and aggro... Yep. There we go. Aggro that bad boy, and then we're going to run. I'm going to run past you. Oh, that didn't work. And we're going to drop that bad boy. We're going to open, drop, open, drop. Grab these. Eat some tuna. Uh, let's just grab... Right, that should be enough. And we're going to sneak over here. Eat the tuna. Oh, so... They hit so hard. I hate it. I hate it so much. Maybe tuna wasn't the best idea. Alright. Get okay, aggroed. We just need one of those. And get aggroed again. Actually, am I safe in here? Can I just TP out? Can we just do... Is this possible? It is possible. Oh, wait, wait. Do I lose everything if I TP? Hmm. 
All right, we're just going to run for it. We're going to run for it, boys. We're going to go for it. Run. Run. We did it. We good. We're out of here. All right. So, we're going to go get geared up and finish off the rest of the waterfall. All right, so we're back trying to finish up this waterfall quest. Can we talk about how nice Runelight makes this? Like, it now it shows you a picture of the rope. Like, okay, you're just going to use the rope here. And do I have it equipped? I do. Okay. And we're just going to open the door. And look at this. It's like, it, it even highlights what crate to look at. Uh, I brought a bunch of cakes and some lobsters. I feel like they'll probably heal better. So we'll see. Look at that. Easy. Easy. All right, I also brought my armor in because we got to run past these fire giants. So hopefully we don't get obliterated. There we go. Look at that. Piece of cake. And we're in. And now we're just gonna... What is it? Just ruin it up. Oh, I thought I screwed up. Hold up. I gotta concentrate. I wish there was like an easier way to do this. Almost got it. Oh, misclicked. They would hate if you like actually mess this up. And then I need to take that off, right? Let's put this bad boy back on. And then Gabriel's amulet on statue of Galerio. And then, right, in the past, if you screwed this up, it, it like, you know, if you just clicked on this, take the treasure, it, it, I think it would, like, kick you out of the dungeon or whatever. But here, with the quest helper, it tells you what to do. So we're just going to, boom, just like that. Look at that. Look at that. Two diamonds, gold bars, and mithril seeds, which I have no idea what are mithril seeds. I, I, I'm going to be honest, I really don't. But we got some level ups. Level 30 in strength. Let's get it. Adamant Warhammers now. And level 40 in tack. It's a good thing we got that rude Simmy. Yeah. Oh, and 32 combat level. Let's get it. Wow, look at those stats. Look at these stats. Let's go. Let's go. Uh yeah, what are these mithril seeds? Are they? They're expensive. I don't know what they're for. I'm going to have to look it up later. But uh, let's let's just go back to our Barbie outpost real quick. You know, we, we worked hard for this, okay? We worked hard for this. This this is it. This is it. Right here. Where you at? Where you at? There you are. Let's put that bad boy on. Yeah, we got them gains, boy. Mm. We look good. All right, well, honestly, I think that's going to be it for this episode. We have a lot of, a lot of, you know, up, um, like levels. Uh, we did a few questing. You know, I'm going to work some more on some more quests and try and bang out a lot more. Uh, I just haven't really had too much time this week. But. You know, I hope you guys liked this episode. And let me know if there's anything you guys want me to do differently. Or if there's anything you guys liked that you want me to keep. I don't really know. I'm, I'm, I'm doing what I can here, okay? Okay. Y'all take care.